Hi guys, welcome to this week's video. And as you can see by the title, I've been on YouTube for an entire year. And let me just say, when I started this, I really didn't know if I was going to continue this long. And now that it has been this long, I don't know why I would have thought that in the beginning. If that makes any sense. Um, you know, if you, if you didn't watch some of my earlier videos or hear me talk about it at all, this is such a huge challenge for me. And in the beginning, I just wanted to see if I could do it and what I would gain from it. So yes, obviously, I can do it. I am doing it. And I'm proud of myself for doing it because I'm extremely shy, antisocial, introverted, whatever words you want to use there. Um, and it, it's, it's hard for me. It's still hard for me, but it's not near as bad as it was in the beginning. So huge accomplishment for myself. And I am very proud of myself for sticking it out. I'm not gonna like ramble on about it, but I just wanna say thank you guys so, so, so much for subscribing, for leaving me comments, and just watching my videos, liking all that stuff. You have no idea how much I appreciate it. And I'm, I'm just overwhelmed that like 95% of my very small subscribing audience are complete strangers. Never met them and they still watch my videos and that's awesome and sure I would love to grow and that's going to be my goal for this year I'm really putting in the work to grow my channel and just see where I'll be come April next year so in order to grow my channel I'm trying to work on an upload schedule that I can actually stick to and let me tell you it's not gonna be easy um, but what I what I would like to do is upload at least one video per week with the possibility of another video thrown in there I'd love to get to like two three videos a week but it's a lot of work it is a lot of work uh, especially having a full-time job now I also have a part-time job <laughs> on top of the full-time job I have crazy stuff going on with my pets um, something else that's about to happen which I'm gonna get into very very shortly and yeah so it's it's extremely difficult to find the time to film edit upload and I'm gonna do my best and along with that I'm also going to try to keep some sort of routine with the topics that I am posting as well because I'm not just a you know one topic channel I go over lots of things pretty much whatever I am enjoying or passionate about I share it on this channel so it could be keto it could be beauty it could be RV it could be just random craft DIY stuff you know and I want to keep it that way even though you would probably ask anybody and they'll say that that's not a good idea um, I beg to differ with that I actually find it extremely boring to watch the same person do the same things in every video so I'm just gonna keep it true to myself and, and I'm sure there'll be people out there that'll find it, find my content entertaining and will want to stick around hopefully and one more thing that you can look forward to within the next couple months and lasting for several months after that um, is I am going to build a house and not just any house but a tiny house and to be even more specific I'm buying a shed and converting it into my house and I've been kind of keeping this under wraps because up until now I wasn't sure how it was gonna work out if it was gonna work out and I didn't want to go announcing something and then and be like oh yeah I'm not doing that by the way um, but now 99.9% .9 sure it is happening and there's gonna be lots of videos to come explaining it but the gist of it is I'm buying a shed a 
it's a custom shed that I helped design, I guess you could say. Um, the shed will be built to Pennsylvania state codes, so it's not going to be the typical backyard shed. It's going to be a house, essentially. I'm buying the shed. I, I don't even like calling it that, but I'm buying the shed. They're going to build it on my property and then leave, <laughs> and the rest is up to me. So I'll have four walls and a roof, four exterior walls and a roof with windows and doors in it. Um, I'm obviously gonna hire some work out. I'm not gonna tackle the electrical, I'm not gonna tackle the plumbing. All that stuff is gonna have to be inspected and I obviously want it to be done right, so I don't even, I don't even wanna attempt that. But aside from that, pretty much everything else I'm going to be doing myself and hopefully with the help of friends and family it's going to be a long process and I'll probably end up living through some of it. Um, once it's in a livable state, I'll probably move in. That's what you guys have to look forward to on top of all of my other content. Um, so if that's something you're interested in, like if you like the RV videos, then stick around because after the RV is done, there'll be the house videos. And I'm so excited, <clears throat> you know. I'll be 40 in less than two months and it seems like I'm just finally starting to get my shit together, <laughs> you know? Um, better late than never, I guess. But yeah, so now that that secret is out, uh, I will slowly start putting videos up about this process that I have been going through, which is a nightmare, um, trying to be my own general contractor for a house build when I have no idea what to do in the process. It hasn't been easy. But anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna get off here now and again thank you so much, so so much from the bottom of my heart for sticking around. And I will see you guys very soon in my next video.